Uh, while you work with others. Oh, well, shit, that's never been my strong suit. Stuffy in here, don't you think? It was a little fresh air, you know. <laughs> I really thought that would work. I didn't realize how built All right, was. Well, it seems I have some time in my hands. What do you want to talk about? Ah, uh, I know who you are. Colonel Brad Park, commander of the ZDC. I'm up on my zombie news, thank you very much. Of course you are. Well, then you also know that the ZDC's mandate is to respond to zombies on U.S. soil. Yes, and confine and silence anybody who knows the truth. Well, I'll up on it, thank you. It's happening again in Willamette. What is? An outbreak. I didn't see anything on the news. How long has it been going on? Going on six weeks now. Really? It's a long time to silence an entire town. Not for them. Who? Oh, the Pentagon. Oh, shit. Well, <laughs> what did you see there? You know what I saw. Nobody knows, Frank. The only reason I found out is because somebody screwed up and passed me a top-level report. This reservist training center, I have yet to see anyone who's actually stationed there. All communications in and out of the town are gone. Hell, the satellite photos have been updated in four months. It is being covered up. But... <clears throat> All that pales in comparison to the mystery of why you, Frank West, are teaching a goddamn night class instead of being two steps ahead of me on this. I quit. You quit? Yes, I quit. Do you know how many outbreaks I've been part of? How many I've covered? And what thanks have I got? Huh? Nothing. No thank yous, no flowers. Just a contact book filled with dead people. National Headliner War 2006. You exposed the first zombie outbreak on US, so I photographed the whole thing. You got some medals, a few letters behind your name. Honorary, of course. Yeah, but let's get to the point. Three weeks later, I tried to expose the Pentagon and the entire US government for their involvement with it, and they bury me! Because you didn't have sufficient evidence. Come with me to Willamette. We expose this bullshit. And you do it right this time. Frank. Frank, there's a lot more stake here than just one town. No. I'm out. Whoever breaks this, they're in for some big gains. Maybe even win back something. But actually, I'm surprised that you let an amateur rip this up from under you. What the hell are you talking about? This is one of your students, isn't it? Ooh. Uh, um, I think you... Whoops. <laughs> Vic. And of course, how did he show me the wrong picture? So I get a Hello, gun. the team you've assembled. Coming up on Willamette. Sure, kill your discretion. Okay, this is about how it went back in the first Will of it. Well, you know, except for the part that we didn't get hit by a rocket launcher, I had to jump out while zombies got on it. 
Actually, I never actually played the first one until I played the Wii version of it. And I played two on the PS3. And off the record on the PS3, and I never played uh, third game. Wakey, wakey! Frank! Frank! What? Wakey, wakey! Why oh, do you keep saying that? Oh, oh man, somebody broke your helicopter. There's that key I've heard so much about. Hold them off! We need some of this gear! Hold them off? With what? Grab a gun, Frank! Stars the best. You ever stop clowning? I should take a good look around. Fine, just meet me at the hotel. Sweet free roam. <laughs> oh, so I can't throw them anymore? And Brad just. No, he's over there. So let's go see what I can do it around here. Oh, God! I'm not sure this is a good idea. Well, that figures. Wes, where are you? Take him to Cena Group. Fine, just meet me at the hotel. I'm trying. Oh no! Damn straight! Unbelievable. This place is crawling. Weren't these people vaccinated? Yes, they were. Required by law. Nationwide. Doesn't make sense. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I 
I would have died if it weren't for you. Thank you. Wes, hey, I'm at the we did make it work for a while. Coming? <sighs> I guess. healing items, but they're not. I desperately need healing. Well, not desperately, but I do need some healing items. Alright, let's go. Sorry, had to stop for a samosa. Samosa? Gonna be a long mission. Shit ton of them. Huh. Let's try it. Connor! You're a um you're an online character. Oh I'm coming back for that assault rifle. Can we get a room? Separate beds though. Oh, you're hilarious. You know, technically speaking, you'd be our first guest. What do you mean? Are you guys from out of town or something? All this shit started on Black Friday, which, not coincidentally, was the day after the grand opening sale. You're saying this mall wasn't even open one day before it got destroyed by zombies? We gotta move. That door leads to the maintenance hallway? Yeah, but the manager locked himself in there when he got bit. Been trying to bust it down for, like, ever. Leave the entrance! Get him! Die! Hey! Hey! We got trouble! Cover me! Well, I get the door open. Yeah! Take that, you fascist! What? Oh, no! Front entrance! Cover me! Yeah. 
Sick of this place. We're good. Oh, no, no. come on. Get any more weapons laying around? Let me click those food. That machete, please. Ah, shit. You were an asshole, Ted, but you didn't deserve this. I'm Connor, by the way. Yeah, nice to meet you. I'm investigating the outbreak. You know anything about how it started? Yeah, yeah. I know these military assholes were guarding something super secret near the mall front entrance. But there was this journalist. What journalist? And she had a boy's name. Can't remember. Vic. Where's Vic now? She was holed up in the mall security center for a while. Might still be there. We should head for the security center. Might be some weapons there. Good plan. Except I'm going solo. What? Look. This outbreak is almost certainly some kind of test. It's probably run by these military jerk-offs. And now I need to find out why. And I'm not gonna be able to do that with some flatfoot holding my leash. No offense. All right, I'll head into town, look into relief efforts. You learn something, you clue me in. Yeah, if I get time. All right, I'm out of here. There's a militia forming out in West Ridge. I'm gonna join up and kill a few more of these pricks. Later, bros. Good luck yeah. to you, West. Yes. Yeah, DLC right there. Online. Luck I got. What I need is a big wet juice of scoop. Oh, I get it. Alright, so let me actually go to my skill points real quick. Oh no, I'm going shooting. <laughs> Items on the ground can be included in crafting. Oh yeah. That, uh, that'll actually help me out a uh, ton. Duh, I gotta stop getting right in front of the fan when I do this. Ugly winter sweater. It's my life. So I don't think right now there's any time limit on the story. Oh, yes. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, start your engines! out. Hey, stay in your lane! Whoa, what's this? 
Beep beep. need that. Alright, let's get out of this. Wasting time. Looter. Alright, Connor said Vic's hold up in the security center. I gotta find out what she knows. Then I'm gonna kick her scrawny ass out of town. Chick magnet. <laughs> ah, look at all this consumer grade shit. <laughs> What's your problem? Cameron's cameras. <laughs> My God. I'm not getting married. I have no reason to be in here. I'll take that revolver, though. And this gun. You guys have no idea how satisfying it is to play another Dead Rising game. Now oh, there's some assholes upstairs throat.
so many hours are going to be put into this game. Uh, this not really a cummerbund and tails guy. Why is there so many revol revolvers around here? And I get skill points way too easy in this game. And again, there are 107 skills in this game to learn and get. This'll do. Ooh, I actually like that. What the hell? You sick assholes! Yeah, guys, I've never been go good with guns in Dead Rising. This reminds me I need to schedule my vasectomy. Look, Frank, I did not want to know that at all. Is that a musket? Oh, that electric power-up, that's for if you have a power suit. Didn't buy my side at all. First mate, steel and needle. I can sniff out a steel while never condoning actual theft. Now I need to follow the old heart. Alright, I wanted to get this machete over here. Give me that shotgun back. I never forget you, Bogo. What's a cop without his pocket? Captain! Navigator Val says we're gonna be sailing to the sea of Sassay's Avings. That can't be right. It's dangerous. Nonsense. Are we not pirates? We laugh in the face of danger. And there's only one thing we see. What's that, sir? Bards. Now cast off. Today we set sail for sailors. Cave of amazing. 